I want to see what it's like on the other side. And what side is that? Non-criminal? Quaylen and Chevelle, what they up to now? What is good, brother? Good and I need some of your swag. My man told me the first chair, all I can do is cut bald heads. Smoke. Everybody needs some of that guy's swag because <laughs> he came in with the swag. I later figured out that that's not even his accent. It was just an accent he was putting on. But anyway, they put him in a corner. He's just supposed to cut the bald guy. So anyway, he's back in Texas. And yeah, he went and worked eventually. Apparently, he went and worked at that spot that the mom found for him. And let's see what he's up to, shall we? I can understand why Chevelle is upset to be Every single time I see this guy, he looks different. Like his eyes are becoming more and more droopy. Some people are saying he's on the who. I don't know what's going on, but something might be going on. But we might never find out. Just like with Heather, we never found out what was actually going on with her. But that's with you. I feel bad, man. And we got problems like every other relationship. Nope. Every other relationship don't have somebody saved in their phone as shy town with the fire emoji with the oh tongue emoji with the, with the what else did he have with the drip emoji no whilst they have a whole other chick with a child that they somewhat have claimed is theirs or somebody's trying to put on them that it's they have to treat the child like it's theirs nobody is in these situations okay this is this is very this is very um few and far between as they say mm -hmm. i need to see what's best for chanel <laughs> who did apparently that's a childhood kind of friend she'll explain it better than i can because right now i'm lost me and jay met in high school we never dated but we had a thing for each other you know i don't know about it but i'm single he's single well, I ain't surprised. I told you about it earlier in the box Oh, so she tells him about what happened with her and Quaylon and this Jay guy, the guy that she she kind of knows from way back when. He's like, yeah, I knew that was gonna happen. I told you you need to be with the boss. And who is he? If you were it, wouldn't she have been with you by now? There's obviously maybe a reason why they were not together before. But yeah, I don't know why these these people keep grabbing people from the sky. This doesn't work out. Oh, he got another one on deck. That one doesn't work out. Oh. It just so happens that that other person that I used to kind of like, kind of mess with, but not really, is also single right now. So yay, yay me. How is that possible? Where are they getting these people from? She's super happy. She's like in that giddy stage of ooh. And I don't even know how long it's been. I mean, this guy is working and everything now, but I don't know how long it's been. And she's already like trying to move on. But Quaylon is not trying to move on. I'll do it. Uh, Shot town, that's the girl I've been talking to. You conversing with her or you see him? Ooh, wee. He said conversing. He didn't say conversating, which a lot of people say, which is wrong. Check your dictionary. Conversating is wrong. He said conversing. Yeah, he got that swag. Go for real. Back in line, man. It's time. I want to see what it's like on the other side, girl. And what side is that? Non criminal? We're the instrument spot. We hit the club thing. Like, I made a decision to stay solid. Okay. Working in the barbershop is doing wonders for his hair. His hair is looking very good. Very, very good. What's wrong with that? Don't lose. He wants to be on the straight and narrow. And he's saying, what's wrong with that? Because they're like, oh, well, what we think is you should just go to Chi Town and go and hit up that girl. Or see what's out here. There's the club scene, this and that. And he's like, but I just want to go the straight path. What's wrong with that? See, that's good. See, Quaylon, I knew I could trust you. Because now he's kind of like, you know, he's, he's showing he's showing himself to be a dude, a real man, man. You know what I'm saying? He's like being faithful or trying to be. And yeah, we don't really know what happened. Whether it was a cheat cheat or an emotional cheat. But either way, Chevelle seems to be moving on. But he isn't. Neither one of them. He doesn't want to lose Michaela or Chevelle. Which is, you know, she's found a dude that actually doesn't mind that she has a kid. So that's good and wants to take care of that kid. I don't even want to think about that. I'm going to do everything I need to do to get him back. Well, good luck with that because Chevelle about to be wound and dined. <laughs> this made me, honestly, you guys, y'all putting me through something. This made me laugh so hard and so much seeing this clip. The way this guy moved, walked in, and she's all like, she, she, she really looks like she's about to faint with this guy that she's known for ages and ages. She's like, she's all of a sudden seeing him in a very different light. I'm supposed to push a chair. It's okay. 
was nice. Me and Jay stopped talking for a while. I just felt like it. I thought you guys were. I thought you guys were friends. Like talking for a while. Do you mean like just talking, conversing, or do you mean talking, like talking? Just not cool to go ahead and talk to him. <laughs> That's <shit was> your <laughs> My friend, he just took you to dinner, okay? I must say, this place looks fine as anything, okay? This place looks really, really fine, but he just took you to dinner, though. Ladies, the bar. It should be... It should be somewhere here. Here. Here where you cannot reach it. So the guy will carry you. Help you touch him. <laughs> hey! <laughs> The way this guy kind of looks at her, it's giving me a little bit of the heebie-jeebies. Just, just a little bit. Just a little, hmm. I, hmm. It's a little bit too much. <laughs> oh, now they decide to spread coro. It's a whole Korovid party over here. The germaphobes have left the building. Hmm. If that were me, I would have been like, okay, so now you think you're gonna get some of my food? I guess not. <laughs> Should have ordered what I ordered. She doesn't look too happy to give him that bite, I'm telling you. I'm sure, it's good too. And then they proceed to say nothing. They did all that saliva exchange and then they decide to just do nothing. Just sit there and be like. Yeah, that was very awkward. <laughs> okay, Jay. Should I take it there, you know? Quite Should you take it where? Where are you about to take it? Where are you about to take it, Chevelle? And his karma gonna reach him. That means God's gonna bless me with more. More men's or more what? More confusion for Maela or more more what? Like she really needs to think this through at this point because Maela is gonna be one confused child. And yes, this happens a lot, and yes, this is a lot of people's story, but yo, do better. Do better. My friend <laughs> well I guess I have nothing more to say if you're not already part of the family make sure you hit thumbs thumb as something I subscribe button comment because I really want to know what you think like because you obviously like this video and hit the notification bell watch you at it I'll see you in the next video with you tomorrow daily videos up in here in the meantime make time for glorious life it's time to start what doing it right God bless <laughs>